What is up, guys? Pie Muffin here, and we are back with some more Trails into Reverie. Last time we hopped back yes. into Lloyd's story. We are in Act 4 for Lloyd, which uh, had us meeting up with the rest of the uh, police department that were able to kind of get away. Uh, and now we're heading up towards Maine's. Uh, really just Lloyd and Noel for the time being, uh, since obviously a huge group would get spotted right away. Trying to get past the EDF soldiers to see if we can meet up with Randy up in Maine's, where they're kind of holding down the fort. So let's get up there and see if we can give Randy some help. Wonder if we can go up here first. I guess we can. Get lost, weird brain worm. Obviously, you can't be going in here. Should be in our chest right up here. There's crate stuff up here. Oh, well, there is a uh, staircase there. Whatever's gonna happen, let's find out. We're almost there. I can finally see mains in the distance. Let's hope Randy and the others are still safe and sound. Agreed, we should hurry. They came from behind us. Enemy sighted. What is Banning's doing here? How did they slip past our defense? This isn't looking good. We're heavily outnumbered. I have no idea how, man how you managed to get past our perimeter, but your luck just ran out. We're taking you both in. Surrender quietly unless you want to be crushed just like that town. They're planning to attack Mains? They have to stop them here and now. Right, we won't them let them set foot in Mains. You fools. What do you hope to accomplish with just the two of you? Capture them. As if you think you're going to be tough enough. You're all a bunch of weaklings. Maybe not as weak as I thought. Yeah, great. You missed anyway. Alright. This is gonna hit, though. Or not. <laughs> Thanks to that guard. Guess they had to hit us with the last one. Perfect. Yes. Well, there's more. The numbers game really is catching up. It's too late to back down now. We can't let them get to mains. You're stubborn, I'll give you that much. 
This has gone on long enough. It's time to finish. There we go. Damn it. It's the Red Reaper. Return fire. Oh, look at that grin. Randy. It really is. Okay. That was epic. I have to save that one. Ooh. <laughs> Ambush failed, fall back. He really looks like he was ready to slaughter them. Oh, close call. Thanks, um, for the assist, Randy. I'll say, we really owe you. You're not hurt, are you? Randy? Aw, he missed his bro. Not reckless enough. That's my bad. I didn't mean to make you worry about us. This wasn't exactly a spur of the moment thing. We were on a mission that was carefully planned with the others. Besides, do you really think we wouldn't come here when we learned you were here? <laughs> そうだな。すまねえ。俺の方こそ心配をかけちまったみてえだ。ロイドもノエルも本当に無事で良かったぜ。Same to you, partner. Randy. 大丈夫ですか? Randy さん. Oh. Well, this explains where they were. あなた方は? Huh, I didn't expect we We'd run into people from Thor's here, too. So you've been taking shelter with the CGF? Speaking of which, where's the first lieutenant and commander? Uh-oh. That's not a good sign. Lloyd then followed the instructions Teal left with him to establish the wire communications. They were then able to make contact with their allies on standby at the foot of the mountain path. Oh wow, they're all here. The EDF briefly withdrawing from the tunnel created an opportunity for the two sides to reunite. And so everyone was able to safely reach mains. Fran looked terrified with whatever Randy just said. And the music should tell us all we need to know. Maine's Mining Village. First time seeing it in 3D. She's hurt. She sustained several gunshot wounds to the chest, and not all of them passed through. She's in critical condition, I'm afraid. Damn. I know, but you're a super famous doctor. Can't you do something? All I have at my disposal is a first aid kit. That's not going to be enough here. She needs to be operated on at a hospital. It'd be too risky to transport her using the route we took to get here. Right now, all I can do is give her stopgap treatment to keep her with us. The rest is in the goddess's hands. Can't believe this is happening. Of course, I'm not going to be sitting idly. I have my pride as a doctor. I'll do everything I can. I just want you to understand that it isn't much. Try to put your faith in her for now. Alright, thanks, Doc. Aww. If you need any more signs that they're a thing, like here it is right here. 
Hang in there, Muriel. I won't fail you. We'll do everything we can, too. I had no idea she was in such a bad state. Apparently, she was covering for civilians during the escape from the city when she was shot. Yeah. That idiot. She's always been one for putting her others before herself. As for the commander, Sonia, I think her unit was separated from ours, too. They're currently holed up at the Moon Temple, but we can't contact them with our communications be are being jammed. So communications will come back once we actually get to the story point when Reen and the others remove the Sonora Seashell from Michelum. That's a name that brings back a lot of memories. So that's what those patrol archisms we fought in the tunnel were keeping an eye on. Yeah, they sent troops to attack it a few times, much like they have here. But that location is even harder to get supplies to than here. There's not going to be any communication cables under the temple for that matter. I don't know how much longer they'll be able to hold out. No doubt we really don't have much time left. We've had our hands full just keeping the town safe as it is, so we haven't been able to do anything for them. Now that you and the Ark cops are here, though, we might just have a fighting chance. I hate to ask so much when you just only just got here, but... There's nothing to apologize for. We came here to help out to begin with. Yeah, and it doesn't seem like we have a moment to waste. So let's go save them, and let's make it safe enough to get first attempt Muriel to the hospital. We'll do all we can to help the plan the operation. I'll go double check our ammunition and supply stores. Thanks, guys. With you in our corner, we got this unlock. Go gather everyone together. We need to get to work to, on a plan to get to the tunnel and save the main unit. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. Guess he's in charge right now since Muriel can't be. Lloyd. Yeah, I know. Randy. And then at least Toa's here. Toa and Randy, you know, were co-workers for quite a while, so... All members of the police and crossbow guardian force who could attend gathered to plot out the upcoming operation. Makes me wonder where Dudley's at, though, since Bacchius is here. As they had been hoping to do this for quite some time, it didn't take long to, until a plan came together. Of course, Toa being the one to come up with it. With everyone well aware they had little time to waste, they chose to spring into action that very day. And so it was that soon afternoon, with the operation scheduled to begin in two hours, Lloyd and friends set about making the final preparations in town. So I assume most of this act is just liberating the Moon Temple in this area. And then after that's probably when Lloyd's going to get the call from Reen. How are your injuries, by the way? Hmm? Oh, yeah. Heh, <laughs> can't complain. Not with what she's going through. You don't, you don't know what it meant to me to hear you guys were all right. If something happened to you two, I don't know what I would have done. He is struggling to keep it together. Muriel's going to be fine. We've just got to believe. Let's get ourselves ready so we can greet her with, again with a smile. It might be worth it to flush out a few details with Toa and Machias beforehand, too. Sure thing. Oh, here it is. So now we just gotta get to this point with uh, Rufus's side, and that'll unlock the third stratum. I think something's changed. You okay, Lloyd? Yeah, I'm fine. Can't say the same about the sense of foreboding I just got, though. Maybe I should look into it later. Well, you know the deal. Just like to see how close it gets to uh, lining up with everything. 
Randy Toa and Machias. Okay. What sweet dream come true is this? Reunited so soon with my beloved Toa. Not to mention several other angelic maidens in the flock. Is this heaven? It's heaven, isn't it? You can tell me. Uh, we can't change the plane. We can change the planes of reality, but you'll never change, Angie. Still, it's a relief to have you with us too. Let's fight together like the good old days. Obviously, I wouldn't want to miss a chance to impress you, my sweet. Of course. Uh, anyone else? So I assume they're all going to be up here. She's gonna be over here. I'm still a little confused as to why I was called here and all. I'll just have to make and help everyone the best I can. That's the spirit. I think I like you. Us girls have to stick together and show all these adults that we can pull our own weight to. Uh, about that, I'm pretty sure. <coughs> I'm pretty sure I'm at least a good seven or eight years old, older than you, if I had to guess. That's a good one. What are you like, 16 at most? She doesn't seem that much older than I'm supposed to look. Uh, why does this always happen? What reason would I have to lie? I was losing my voice. Had to have some water real quick. All right. So Machias and Randy should be over here, I guess. I swear if they're not, I don't know how I'm going to keep passing them. Where is Randy? How do I keep doing this? How do I keep missing someone who's so clearly supposed to be somewhere? Yeah. I wasn't expecting to run to Rufus of all people while in here. I can only hope he's grown as much as his younger brother has. Speaking of uses, maybe I should ask him to sit down and have a drink with me sometime. Huh. As long as it's not coffee. Oh, Randy might be... Randy might be at the front with Noel. Gotta be, right? Yep. I seriously got dragged into some freaky other dimension with every major player from Crossbell and Erebonia, huh? I got this itch in the back of my mind that there's some real major business waiting for us in the real world, but I can't remember. And I'm sure we'll figure out sooner or later. I'm gonna get my head in the game and gear up. Let's roll. All right, well, there you have all of that. So, uh, cool. You know the deal. Back to mains. Once we have our whole actual, like, squad figured out, then I'll uh, probably go back to the corridor to gear that group up. Uh, guess it wouldn't hurt to visit the general. <laughs> ドクリスコクの時を思い出すな。俺の番だな。よし。まあ、住民たちには毎度面倒をかけしまって申し訳ねえが。その意味でも泣き言は言ってられねえ。今は少しでも踏ん張らねえとな。そうだな。おいよ
Yeah, we won't let you down. Hell no, we won't. If they try coming through here, some lips are gonna get busted, and they won't be ours. Woo! I guess it would help having a former Saber Viper here. He definitely knows how to fight. Oh, I thought this was Kate. The help of the people of Maine's and Crossville City of Acuees have been invaluable to us. They more than lived up to their end of the deal, so now it's time to live up to ours. Yeah, cool. Uh, right, this is the old mine. Mine Chief Hoffman. Guess he just doesn't want anyone going in there. Oh! Where's his wife, though? Randy, thank you Hi, Lloyd. Hi, Colin. Good to see you too, Mr. Hayworth. I'm glad to see your family was able to evacuate safely. Also, Randy told me you've been a huge help around here, Inspector Regnitz. He was exaggerating, I assure you. All of us were able to make it here thanks to the Guardian Forces evacuation efforts. It pains me knowing Muriel was gravely wounded protecting us. I can't help but feel partially responsible. I'm so sorry. Come on now, you don't have anything to feel sorry for. Muriel would be the first to tell you she doesn't regret doing what she did. Besides, we wouldn't be managing to get by here if it weren't for you and Macchiato helping organize our supplies. So don't, don't beat yourself up over that, okay? Thank you, I'll try not to. I admire how strong you are, Randy. Most people wouldn't be able to stay so positive when someone they care deeply about is in a critical state. Bringing it up also doesn't help. Whoa there, pump the brakes, Macchiato. I think you got me and Muriel all wrong. It's not like we're, you know. I mean, yeah, we're pretty close. Yeah, at least he's admitting it now. We enlisted in the CGF around the same time, and she always looked out for me, even after the former commander had me discharged. Whether it was after I joined the SSS, after the cult incident, the last independence bid, or even when I left to work for in Erebonia. She never changed. Muriel, su Muriel supported me no matter what. She counted on me like no one else ever had. I don't know why she put so much faith in someone who was kicked out of the CGF, never got it. But the last thing I want to do is let her down. I'll do whatever I have to make good on it. Because someone has to make the EDF answer for what they did. Oh, Randy. I once lost someone dear to me and found myself lost for a long time as a result. So I can't say I don't empathize with how you must be feeling, but allow me to offer a word of advice. Just as you care for others, others care about you the same way. Don't forget it. This is going to be a dangerous operation. We're going to need to be very careful to come out of it on the other side. Value your life and take care of yourself. Also, don't forget you have allies, me included. I've got your back like I would one of my classmates. And I intend to do everything I can to support you as well. Me too. I want to help the people the same way that nice lady helped us. Thank you, Mr. Hayworth. You too, Colin. You guys, you're going to make me as red as my hair. But yeah, I'm counting on you. Man, that was really heavy. Let's see if they got anything here. Wait, they use the same weapon? How? She uses pistols. Well, whatever. So this is currently going to be our group, I guess. We'll go with that for now. I think the other exclamation point was at the, uh, the mayor's place. Yeah, or village chief, rather. Where'd Kate get off to? 
must be around here. Oh, she's right here. Hey, Lloyd, good seeing you. We're all done with the prep work. We'll roll out, we'll roll out as soon as I give the order. Glad to hear it. It's nice having some good old police backup again, like the old days. We know we can count on you guys. I'm just glad I was able to make it in time to lend a hand. The city's in another tight bind. It's gonna take all our combined efforts to get the job done. And I mean all of us. Lean on each other and don't do anything reckless, all right? Yeah, got it. For you? Is she the, is Amy, she's, oh hey, how's it going, SSS? I'd heard the EDF has the town surrounded, but trust you to get past them. You aren't just sayers, you're doers. Maybe that's what makes you so cool. Wait, uh, maybe not the best time to gush over you, huh? Let's keep at it, at that for now. We're all rooting for you in the op, in the operation, so good luck. Make them regret thinking they could pick a fight with us or the CGF. Is she the one that was, no, that was a blue haired girl. There's like a blue haired girl that was always in the, like, front of mains that was always like, gushing over people. What? Certain? Is that you, Lloyd? Certain, it's good to see you managed to evacuate here. Oh, this guy, he's one of your pals from the Fisherman's Guild, right? Thanks for all your help around here. We seriously owe you guys big time for pitching in. Only wish I could do more, to be honest. I can't prepare food the way I'd like without any good fishing spots. Still, I've got survivalist skills in my back pocket, so I can make do just fine. Wow, I had no idea. You've always been incredibly helpful, so I shouldn't be surprised, though. Don't mention it. I'm happy to pull my weight around here. Who's down here? Hey, kiddo. Alec? Mayor Bixon's a lot younger than I recall. We've got so many dependable young folks here, especially two from the SSS. There's finally light at the end of the tunnel. Without that, this old, feeble body could do more. Allow me to express my deepest gratitude. There's no need for that, Mr. Mayor. Hell, it's our fault this town got caught up in this mess. No, this is the whole of Crossville's problem. We can't sit idly by while the Guardian Force falls. They're the guiding light to our freedom. We must overcome this wall together. Besides, they, along with you all, have been our allies since the Crossbell Independence Movement. It should come as no surprise that the whole darn town has come together to cheer you on. Take this with you, I insist. May it serve you well. Oh, thanks. Are you sure about this? Thank you so much, Mr. Mayor. We'll have to give our next mission 101% so we don't let the town down. You guys busy going over the details of the mission? Yep, I figure I'll cram right up until it's go time. Not to mention the cooperation of the Guardian Force and Town Guard will be key factors in the success of this mission. Right, the more we go over the details, the better. Considering we'll be collaborating with others and commanding our own forces, this plan is seriously looking airtight. You can thank Toa for that. Seriously, we owe you. We're the ones who dragged you into this mess, yet you've been a tremendous help every step of the way. Come on, Randy. It feels like yesterday when we were still co-workers. And I'm sure Reen and Yuna are working to make things right in the Empire as we speak. Now I know Alisa and Tita are safe. I want to do everything in my power to tie up loose ends. I got you. Thanks for real. Thor's branch campus, right? I never did end up getting to go. You were in charge of the combat tactics class, right? Yeah, though the classes were mixed, so it's not like there was a huge distinction between students. For as much as Class 7 hogged the limelight, there was no shortage of other unique kids at Thor's. Let me put it this way, whether in class or in the field, I was never bored. You were an awesome instructor, Randy. You looked out for not only the students, but Rain and I too. I know you were supporting everyone at the branch campus from behind the curtains. Come on, Toa, you're making me blush here. That definitely checks out. I heard he was much the same in the Guardian Force. You know, the older brother type you could always depend on. Oh yeah, that's Randy to the letter in the SSS, too. Once a Randy, always a Randy, I guess. Now, you do realize I'm standing right here, don't you? You're embarrassing me here. 
But man, this brings me back to some warm, fuzzy memories. Not that it's even been so long. Aww. Drinking with rain. Not so late to be saying this, but I really do wish I could have seen the kids graduate. Randy. It's not too late as long as we put an end to all of this. I'll be sure to invite you to the graduation, so long as you keep being the random we all know and love. Promise? Yeah, it's a promise. That should wrap up our patrols. Yeah, just about time for us to begin the operation. We gotta pull this one off. Hey, Randy? Are you off for taking a small break before we begin the mission? Uh, sure, I don't mind. There's a lookout platform in the back of the town work for you. The view is pretty killer from that spot. Sounds good. Let's finish whatever we were doing and head over there. We'll probably do this last scene and then call it a video. Unless it throws us right into the mission. Oh. All right, let's hold off then, because it's probably going to be a lot moving uh, forward from here. All right, so next time we'll have this uh, little talk between Lloyd and Randy. Obviously, Lloyd probably has something to say to Randy, because Randy definitely seems off right now. So uh, he's probably going to be kind of messed up in the mission if we go in like this. But uh, yeah, so next time we'll have the talk, we'll start the mission and uh, continue on. We're trying to liberate the mains area from the EDF, so... That's going to be it, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe for our to the channel. I'll see you all next time. Have a wonderful day, everyone.